This tutorial will show you how to scan using the InOS driver. Note that some formats are not available in the InOS scan driver. It is always recommended to download and install the printer software to get the best features for your printer. From the desktop, right click on the start button and select control panel. Go to View Devices and Printers. You can see that this is the printer that you have just installed using the InOS driver. Now, right click and you will see that there is an option to start scan. We shall create a shortcut. As Windows cannot create a shortcut here, we shall create it on the desktop. There, you have the shortcut to your printer. You can now close this dialog box. At the shortcut, you may want to do a right click and select Start Scan. This is the scan interface for the InOS scan drivers. You'll notice that the scanner is the printer that you have just installed. There's a profile and photo is the default. You can also scan documents. Take note, for documents under the file type, there is no option to save as a PDF. This is the limitation of the InOS scan driver. We'll go back to Photo. The source will select it as flatbed. It will also detect whether your printer is able to scan on one side or scan on both sides. For the color format, we want a color scan, so we will leave it as is. And the resolution default is 300 dpi. We will leave it as that. Next, place the document that you want to scan on the flatbed and click scan. One new photo or video was found. We want to go to next and we want to import. It will bring up the location where the imported file is saved. Let's take a look. This is the document that you have placed to scan as a photo. And this is how you do the scanning using the InOS scan drivers.